After an underwhelming 2016 with the Texas Rangers organization, Dylan Tate is beginning to show the promise that led him to be the fourth overall pick in 2015. The 23-year-old was drafted out of UC Santa Barbara by the Texas Rangers and was one of three pitchers sent to the Yankees in the 2016 Carlos Beltran trade. Now in his first full season in the Yankees organization, Tate has been nothing but dominant with high A Tampa. He's a talented young athlete with good stuff. It's a good combination. Me having that carefree attitude makes it a little bit easier for me to go up there and really get after whatever it is that I'm doing. And if I want to throw something, I'm able to throw it with more conviction because I'm carefree about it. Here it is. Hit it if you can. Watching him pitch is just everything is so loose. Kind of looks like body parts are going everywhere, but it's all controlled, I guess. But just everything's so loose and it looks like Tate has three pitches, but it's his fastball that's grabbed people's attention. He has rediscovered the velocity on his fastball and is hit 97 miles per hour this year. Well, he's got a power fastball. He's going to be a guy in the mid-90s. He can go both ways. I mean, he's got that slider that goes down and away to righties with some depth, and he's got the changeup that goes the other way. So he can cross the plate with two secondary pitches, and he's got a live fastball. There's a lot of pitches for strikes, gets guys out, changes speeds, herky-jerky, and just jumps on people. I don't think people don't hit him very well, which is awesome. After struggling with the Rangers and then missing the beginning of 2017 with a shoulder injury, Tate now knows what it takes for him to succeed with the Yankees. His attention to detail is evident, as his record through his first three starts stood at 3-0 with 21 strikeouts and a 1.47 ERA. Everything looks really smooth. He's doing a great job. Ball's coming out nice. Getting on top of the slider real good. Good depth. Change up still there. So he's he's been looking good. and. Uh, I'm sure he's going to continue. Being in tune with what's going on with my hand and my delivery is a big component in me, you know, competing at a higher level. If anything I've learned since getting hurt and going down and having to go to extended is your arm has to be in good shape. So it definitely starts with your shoulder care and taking care of the rest of your body. He's a good worker. He's a good kid. I expect him to just keep on getting better, just keep that boy healthy and let him go. You can see more Yankees on demand and Yankees scoreboard content by clicking here. And you can subscribe to our YouTube channel right there.